Hello, and welcome to another episode of Clarinet Lessons with me, your host, Mr. Doug Dale. For today, you're going to need your clarinet and your standard of excellence book. So why don't you get those and we'll be right back. Welcome back. Did you know that there are more than 10 different kinds of clarinets? Mostly in band, you'll see this kind of clarinet, which is the one that you are playing at home. This is a B flat or soprano clarinet. Um, there are clarinets in E flat and clarinets in A and even clarinets in D. There are some clarinets that are really big and some clarinets that are really small. So, we are going to start today with our warm up, our long tone warm up to help warm up our clarinet and warm up our lungs for breathing and playing. Here we go. We're going to start with the note C, okay? Thumb, one, two, three. And then we'll play D, thumb, one and two. Then we'll play E, we're pinching the clarinet, thumb and first finger. Then we'll play F, just the thumb. And then we'll play open G. And then remember the note we had last week, A. So we're going to play A and add A to our warm up. Here we go. C, D, E, F, G, and A. Eight counts each. Here we go. One, two, three, four. D, two, three, four. E, two, three, four. F, two, three, and. G, two, three, four. A, two, three, now it's your turn. Nice job on those long tones. Now we're going to warm up our fingers and play song number 25 on page nine. This is called One Step at a Time. Here we go. One, two, three, four. Now it's your turn. Nice job on that finger warm up. I really like that song. Now it's time for our lesson. And today we're going to learn a new note. And this note is called B. B like the word benevolent or bibliography. 
or banana. Wow, that was certainly appealing. So, if you look at song number thirty-six on page eleven of your book, you can see that the note B is played by pressing our thumb, first, second, and third finger on our left hand, and then we're going to skip the first key and go right to the second one on our right hand down at the bottom. See, so this is how we play the note B, and it sounds like this. <laughs> So let's get this note into our ears. I'll play it four times, and you can play with me, and then you can try it on your own. All right, here we go. Here's the note B to get it into our ears. One, two, ready, and one, two, three, four. One, two, three. Four. One, two, three, four. Now it's your turn. Great job. Now we're going to do a little exercise. Song number thirty-six, Mark Time, is a great way for us to practice getting that B under our fingers. Okay, so、um, I'm going to play first, and then it'll be your turn.、Uh, remember, there's a fermata at the end of the song, so be your own conductor. Here we go, number thirty-six on page eleven, Mark Time. One, two, three, four. <laughs> Now it's your turn. Great work. Lastly, we're going to put this note into a song. This is called "Mary Ann," song number thirty-eight on page eleven. A wonderful song from the West Indies. I encourage you to go on YouTube、um, or find a recording、uh, of how this song really goes because it's a really fun song. Okay, here is "Mary Ann." I'll play, then you play. One, two, three, and. Now, your turn.
Great work, everybody. I am looking forward to next week's session. I want to say that I miss all of my students very much, and I heard, know that all of my instrumental music teacher colleagues miss all of our student, all of their students very much too. We look forward to seeing you again. Keep those hands washed and have a wonderful week, and we'll see you soon. Bye.